You already know all things sports and entertainment, and we can completely disagree. Well, let's get this conversation started, all right? Also, also salute to the LDBC, but Angel Reese, who, uh, you know, whether you like her or not, some of y'all don't really like her because Caitlin Clark won Rookie of the Year, and I get it, you know, she's supposed to be um, kind of like the face of the NBA, but you need a villain, and Angel Reese has definitely accepted being a villain. Um... You know, so she's been doing her thing as well. But it looks like, and uh, I was hoping this was AI, but a pan. I'm not going. I'm not comfortable showing this on YouTube. But I mean, if you just, you know, either go to Twitter or look up Angel Reese. Apparently, she did a, a modeling in lingerie a while ago while she was at LSU. And uh, I guess these these photos have resurfaced now. I like the photos personally. You, you feel me? Like, she, <laughs> you know, I ain't got no problem with it. But a lot of people are catching backlash or are mad or she's catching backlash, should I say, because I remember when she did that press conference and she said, you know, you can't the way she's been treated and all of this and said she's been sexualized. Well, Angel, when you take pictures like this, you know, the pictures that I'm not going to show, but I go on Twitter, if, if you take pictures in lingerie, you're going to be sexualized. I'm sorry. That's just one of the things that come with it. You're going to be objectified. Nobody's going to look at you and go, oh my God, she's such a great person, such a great basketball player. And when you show on your pretty much your entire body, I mean, that's not how people are wired. That's especially not how men are wired. And, you know, a lot of times, a lot of these sisters, they, they, um, they live in this reality, this warped reality where you can do stuff like that and you expect somebody to jump in your inbox and say, excuse me, ma'am, can, can I take you to dinner? No, when you show your body like that, what you think people going, why do you think other cultures don't do that? You know what I mean? But it's like, okay, if you want to do that, fine, right? I'm a support. I'm clearly looking at the photos. But at the same time, I'm not looking at you going, oh, my God, how many are you going to make the All-Star game next year? No, I'm trying to see what's up. You know what I mean? Shoot, trying to get flown out to the A. So, you know, she gonna have to understand that. I mean, again, uh, uh, look at D'Angelo. Y'all remember D'Angelo back in the day? I couldn't hear, that's all I was hearing about. And I'm talking about people when I was in my grade, cause I think I might've been in middle school when uh, he came out with How Does It Feel to people that was in their fifties and sixties talking about that video, you know? So he, the same thing goes with him. So I don't know, man, sisters, y'all got to stop, stop, stop this foolishness. Angel, please stop. If you're going to put yourself in thongs and skin tight clothes and all of that, then you're going to have to, you're going to have to accept what comes with it. Now, if you don't want that, then you need to dress like Caitlin Clark or, or these other basketball players. You know what I mean? You can wear a dress, but again, you in, I'm going to look at you, you in lingerie <laughs> with a thong on and you don't understand why you why people are looking at you as in a complete object and not just angel reese the basketball player you know and and, and at some point people are going to completely put you in the um the 304 the 304 um category even if you're not you know what i mean so people got to understand that yeah it's cool but, but there's always gonna be a backside that come with it but no i don't want to hear nothing no i don't want to hear nothing from her ever again talking about being sexualized and i don't want to hear nobody else talk about that if you're gonna post stuff like this she ain't no different than you ever notice girls like on facebook and instagram they take pictures and they showing their butt but then if somebody jump in their inbox they'll immediately post why y'all in my story why why y'all in my inbox because you posting it just admit you would like the attention if you admit that then fine cool we can move forward but y'all it's like y'all want people to, to to like it but then don't think nothing else outside of it but the like button but hit the like button and that's just not reality historically i mean <laughs> historically if you go back a couple hundred years i mean what would, do you really think she would be considered a, a a a public figure you know but again i ain't got no problem with, i'm gonna keep looking at stuff like this i'm sure a lot of y'all will too but this this is the this is the the back the downside that come with it so you know but i just want to get my quick thoughts about it tell me what y'all think